everyone. I just wanted to post another quick review, hopefully quicker than my last one, um, about the Bum Genius 4.0 diapers and sort of my quick review of them as well as how they work. I know there are a million of these videos out there, but when I was trying to decide which diapers to use, I watched all of them, I feel like. So I'm going to add another to the bunch. So the diapers that I use are the Bum Genius 4.0 pocket diapers. Um, they seem to be among one of the most popular brands to use, as well as Bum Genius makes three different models um, of diapers, and the 4.0s seem to be among the most popular even amongst those. So um, this is actually the Hummingbird color, um, which I really like. Um, I have a boy but I have decided and gotten almost all of the colors, whether they're girl or boy colors, um, I love them all. So what we have here in front of the diaper is the inserts that come with the diaper. This here is the newborn or stay dry doubler um, insert. And the diaper, when you get it, comes with the cover here and then the two inserts, the newborn, which is like a thinner insert here, and then this is the stay dry insert that it comes with. So it comes with, with two, which I really liked because um, if you need to later on, you can double up the inserts for more absorbency and you don't necessarily have to go out and buy more inserts right away, which is nice. Um, I started later on with my son, so we actually have not yet used this newborn insert. It's much thinner um, than the, the full-size insert, and um, I think it would work well for a newborn for a short period of time at least, but for now, for us, it wouldn't be enough absorbency. My son is 17 months old, um, and we are actually able to still just use this one insert by itself. Um, the insert, when you get it, has these snaps on it, which I have a couple lined up here to show. So this is the insert at its smallest setting. Um, it's snapped all the way down to this snap here. And if you were to put this in your diaper, um, it would coincide with the smallest rise snaps on this diaper. So you would put this snap down to this one here and the diaper gets much smaller um, to accommodate um, a newborn or close to newborn size. I've heard that these diapers don't fit right from birth um, because they are a one size diaper. Um, so you end up having to switch to these around 10 pounds or so. But um, I like the feature of it being a one size diaper because for the most part you can use it almost from the very beginning up until potty training, which appealed to me a lot because one of the reasons I wanted to switch to cloth diapers was um, for cost savings, and to me that made a lot of sense. So um, we do have the inserts here. The second, This is the second size snap, um, snapped to almost the very top here, um, which would coincide with snapping these two snaps together. So then the diaper has like a middle, medium size. Um, and I can show that in a moment here. But when the diaper is in its full largest size like this, um, then the insert is just fully unsnapped like so. Um, and you just insert it right in the diaper. So let me show you how that works. Um, inside the diaper here, um, it's got this micro suede fabric here, which just wicks away the moisture from your baby so your baby doesn't get wet um, and rashes. In this is the back of the diaper here. There's a flap, and inside of here is where you would insert the insert here into the diaper. Um, you just insert it all the way through, push the little flap down, and and you're good to go here. So um, when you're putting the diaper on, it has these really nice stretchy tabs, which I really like. Um, and you just snap the diaper on. There's lots of videos online about how to um, put on a diaper because it's a little bit different than disposables. 
if you're looking for tips on that. Um, so you just snap the diaper and it's on your baby and you're good to go. Um, the other nice thing is these rise snaps I was discussing. So let's see if I can unsnap this one handed. The snaps are nice and strong, which is good unless you're trying to unsnap them one handed. So let's see. I am going to wish that I was left-handed. But anyway, um, there we go. So I've unsnapped the diaper. What you would do um, if you wanted to wear it on a smaller baby, I'm just gonna take the insert out of here. Just slides right out. And inside the diaper, on the outside here are your snaps. So. If you want it to go on like a newborn, you're just going to snap these snaps together here. And then once you've got your rise settings snapped, they can just stay snapped all the time. They say that you don't need to unsnap them when you are washing them or anything. So they can just stay snapped. And when it's snapped like this, it looks like so. And then you would just insert this into the pocket. Um, you don't want to put this directly on your baby because microfiber will dry out your baby's skin. But So you insert it in the pocket and then pretend it's in there. And put it on the baby. So as you can see, it is much smaller on this setting. Um, it seems like it would fit a pretty small baby, which is really nice. So. I guess all in all this review hasn't been all that um, groundbreaking compared to the ones that I've seen, but I just wanted to give another review of the diaper. I really like it. Um, I'd be happy to answer any questions that anybody had. Um, go ahead and leave a comment and um, thank you for watching.